I'm here with Wendy Padbury, who played Zoe. Hello, nice to meet you. Hey, nice to meet you. Are you enjoying the convention today? Yes, it's huge. I've never been here before, never been to the NEC, and um, I, hadn't, I had no preconceived idea of what it was going to be like, but this is massive. Will you be coming back, do you think? Maybe one day, who knows, if I get invited. Yep. Hopefully. Um, so, do you play Zoe opposite Patrick Troughton's Doctor? Um, obviously, with a lot of the, some of the old companions have been coming back in recent years, um, especially around the 50th anniversary. Is there any chance that you come back? Well, again, who knows? I mean, I think it's highly unlikely, but um, it's Doctor Who, so anything is possible. It would be nice, I have to say, just even to do a scene or something in the, uh, with the new Doctor, but, you know, have to wait and be asked. Now, you've done work with Big Finish, haven't you? Yes, I did. In fact, I did a story last week with Fraser, a Cyberman story, and we're doing... Um, I'm doing another story next week with Colin Baker, but I don't know what... I haven't seen that script yet. Uh, but, uh, yeah, the, the Big Finish keep on, you know, writing good stories for us to record. Do you enjoy working with some of the other actors from over the 50 years? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I always love working with Colin Baker, and I always love w working with Fraser, of course, because that just kind of takes us both back uh, so many years. So, yeah, no, it's, it's really excellent. And when you do the audio dramas, is it easy to get back into the character? It's, it's easy in the head. It's more difficult vocally because, obviously, f it, Zoe was 40-whatever years ago, six years ago or something, so, and I was quite, quite squeaky and had very high, I had a very high voice. Now, I don't. Um, so, that's a little more tricky to accomplish, to get that squeak, that, that range back. Um, but with a little tweak of a knob, you know, technology is a marvelous thing. Um, but yeah, no, it, it, we slip into it really easily. And I love listening to Fraser do Patrick because I think he does it brilliantly. Now, obviously, you've been in it from very early on. How does it feel seeing the show grow over so many years? Well, it's interesting because it was very, it, you know, it went through the doldrums at some point, went off the air, was never really as appreciated as it is now. Um, and now it's huge. Um, but still, you know, most of us feel very proud that we were part of it originally. Um, have you been watching any of the revived series? Uh, the Peters, Peters. I saw the. I went, took my grandchildren to see the the screening of the very first episode at the Odeon in Leicester Square and thought it was excellent. Um, and I think I have unfortunately not seen any more because I live in France and I haven't got English telly. But uh, it's, I think he's, a, he's going to be a brilliant doctor. Well, thanks very much for your time, and I hope you enjoy the rest of the convention. Uh, thank you very much. You too.